What's up friends, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and in today's video I'm going to show you how to record your voice or do a voiceover in Windows 11 without using any third party applications. You can simply do it from within Windows, right? So go ahead and click the Windows key on your keyboard and you want to type in sounds, right? Now once you type in sound, you will find the sound recorder up. Now, if you open it for the first time, it will take a moment to download and install it for you. But once it's finished, it will look just like this. Now, before you go ahead and hit this big red record button here to start your recording, you want to do a few things. So you want to click the tree that's on the uppermost right hand side and you want to go on settings. From here, you want to click on the drop down that says record format. And from here, you can select MP3 or you can select WAV. It's really up to you. I will go ahead and choose MP3, right? Now, the next thing that you want to do is to adjust the quality of your audio. And I would recommend either use the best for the highest quality or you want to use the high for which is recommended. So you go ahead and choose whichever one. You can test both of them and see which one works for you, right? Now, after you finish that, guys, you can simply go ahead and click on back. You also want to ensure that you select the appropriate mic. So if you're using the microphone from the computer, you want to ensure that you select the appropriate one. If you have a different microphone or you have a headset that you're using, go ahead and select the correct one from here. Now, once you select that, all you have to do, just simply go ahead and start with the recording and you'll be able to record your voice. Right now, once you're finished with the recording, guys, just simply go ahead and stop it and you'll have your recording right here. I know you might be wondering, where are these recordings stored after recording? Because you do have an option to save it. Just simply click the three dots again and you simply want to click show in folder and this will take you over now to a folder where it's stored. So it will store under your account, documents, and now you have a sound recording folder. You can go ahead and you can listen to that file. You can also rename it and you can use it for whatever you want. Very easy and very simple. Now guys, I really hope that you found this tutorial very helpful. And if you do, go ahead and give this video a like and share your comments below. I'd really appreciate that. And if you're seeing the channel for the first time, well, welcome to Drew Tutorial. I'm Anjo, and I really appreciate if you hit the subscribe button below to help grow this community. And also, so that you'll never miss out when I release another helpful tutorial just like this one. Thank you very much, and see you next time.